Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. In this tutorial video, I'm going to show you on how to take admission to BTEC, MSc and PhD program at Nagaland University. If you are watching this video and new to the channel, please do not forget to like, share and subscribe. And without any delay, let's get started with the video. Before we proceed with the online application form, there are few informations that I want to highlight. The first one will be the intake capacity for different departments under BTEC, PhD and MSc program. So under the Department of Agriculture, Engineering and Technology, 30 seats has been allotted for BTEC program and 5 seats for PhD. Under Biotechnology, 30 seats for BTEC and 10 seats for MSc. Under Computer Science and Engineering, 30 seats for BTEC. Under Electronics and Communication Engineering, 30 seats for BTEC. And for Information Technology, 30 seats for BTEC and 8 seats for PhD. So these are the allotments that has been advertised for the academic session 2024 to 25. Next, we have the criteria for admission. So I request the candidates to kindly go through the criteria through which you can take admission under the programs. Next, we have the allocation of seats. So under BTEC Fresh Entry 10 plus 2, these are the seat allocation that has been made for different states which you can see on the screen. Then we have the selection for admission into PhD program which you can see on the screen and for the selection for admission into MSc program which will be based on the performance in graduation. Followed by the fee structure for BTEC program and for PhD. The university also provides transportation facilities and for the students who want to avail, they have to pay 600 rupees per semester. Next, we have the fee structure for MSc program. Next, we have the departments. The first department is Agriculture, Engineering and Technology. Next, we have the Department of Biotechnology. Next, we have the Department of Computer Science and Engineering. Next, we have the Department of Electronics and Communication Engineering. And the last one, we have the Department of Information Technology. And below, we have an important dates and the fees for the admission to different programs that is the online application form has already been started from 10th may and the last date will be 12 july 2024 the declaration of the merit list will be out on 16 july and the date of counseling and admission will be on 25th july followed by the shortlisted candidates for the entrance exam and the date of entrance and interview for phd program will be on 24th july which then the classes will be commenced from 31st July for all the programs and the application fee for the program are as follows for BTEC the general and OBC category have to pay 250 and 200 for SC or ST for PhD program 200 for general or OBC 150 for SC and ST and for MSc program 200 for general and OBC and 150 for SC or ST so these are the application fees that will be charged during the application form and here are the contact details if you have any queries you may kindly contact on the given numbers and you can also email on this email address and share your queries in regard to the admission process now let me take you to the filling up of application form for different programs for this the link is attached in the video description if you click on the link it will redirect you to this particular page here you may kindly proceed with the course to which you want to take admission so first one i will be highlighting about the btech program so the candidate have to click on apply online and it will take you to this particular site here you need to first click on register for the new users and you need to enter your username email address password and then you need to click on create new account after the account has been created you can login and then you can enter your username and password after which you can click on login and it will redirect you to this particular site here you can select for different programs so the first one will be for btec and this is the application form for the btec program so in the first part you need to click on whether you are fresh or lateral entry based on that you have to click on this checkbox and below this you have to enter your personal details 
such as your full name, mother's name, father's name, guardian's name. Next, we have category. Here, you need to select your category. If you belong to OBC, ST, SC, EWS category, you need to upload your category certificate. Next, we have religion. So, please select your religion. And then, if you are physically challenged, you need to click on yes. If not, then you can click on no. Next, we have the permanent address. You need to enter your permanent address followed by corresponding address. Then we have mobile number, phone number, email address. And here you need to enter your academic details starting from your class 10. Then you need to upload your marks or grade accordingly based on the subjects which you can see. If you have qualified JE, then you need to click on yes. Otherwise, you can click on no. Next, we have CUET UGP qualified. Here you can click on no and this is a very important point since the campus is going to be shifted to another campus which is in Kohima. If you are a resident of Kohima, click on yes, otherwise click on no. If you need hostel accommodation, click on yes. Next we have the university quota. Here if you are applying through university quota, then you need to click on yes and then you need to upload the quota document otherwise click on no after which you need to upload the documents such as your color passport photograph under this extensions then the signature class 10 admit card class 10 certificate and mark sheet and accordingly you can make the payment after that you need to enter the payment reference number and you need to upload the payment receipt after which you need to click on yes and then you need to click on submit so that is for the BTEC program. Next, we have MSc Biotechnology. So this is the application form for the MSc Biotech. Below, you need to enter your personal details. Here, you need to upload your documents. And for the application fee, you can click on the link and make the payment. And then you can click on yes and then you can submit. And the last one, we have the PhD program so you have to click on the program where you want to take admission so based on your interest and eligibility you can click and then you need to fill up the details here you need to enter your details from class 10 onwards and you need to select the category where you want to either go through full-time or sponsored next we have the hostel accommodation facility if you want it you can click on yes otherwise you can click on no after that we have the documents section here you need to upload all the documents and it has to be under self attestation followed by the payment details and then you can click on yes and you can submit so this is the information that i want to highlight in this video if you have any doubts and queries you can kindly contact to the given contact details which i have highlighted in the video or you can drop it your comments on the comment section with this i want to end my video thank you and keep watching shisak tombo